Fuck that, fuck that, fuck that. Nah, fuck that flirt shit. We gonna talk about how Kelly became a flirt to a motherfucking pervert to a motherfucking, yeah, you know what I mean? Doing 30 years. Look, man, a lot of them rich millionaire niggas, they try to use money as influence, which is crazy. You know, we still got to believe we are one under the sun. I don't give a fuck how much money you got, what you got going on. Um, You know what I always talk about? Um, we need to practice reciprocity more. Do unto me as I want done on you. Come on, you know you want nobody slutting your little young daughter out, so therefore you ain't gonna do no shit like that. You ain't gonna want nobody steal from you, you ain't gonna steal from them. Reciprocity is what's more needed, you know, in humanity and shit. I ain't even gonna say the black community, I'm gonna say reciprocity is needed altogether in humanity and shit. And we ain't. Whether you study the Bible or believe in Jesus Christ or a fucking cow with pink spots, I don't care. Reciprocity. That's a simple law that, that will make everything better. Do unto others as you want done unto you. Ain't shit got shit to do with the Bible, even though it coincides with the Bible verse. Um, just treat people like you want to be treated, man. You, you got people with money and influence, like R. Kelly, Bill Cosby. Puff Daddy, that do shit, whereas though they feel like their money can patch everything up, but what about the people feelings who you hurt? You know what I'm saying? Money don't, money is not the end all be all. Money, no, let me tell you something. Money is a good fixer upper. It make you feel better, but at the end of the day, if you got some shit you dealing with eternally, the money will make you feel good for a little bit, but eventually, It'll regress to the mean. You'll be going back. And everything regress to the mean. Meaning, everything's come back to its natural state. Even problems, people, everything. You know? So, treat people how you want to be treated, man. That money can't cover everything up. Because when the feds come, your money can't buy your way out of federal indictments. I don't give a fuck how much money you got. Look at Harvey Weinstein. That nigga was worth $30 billion. He ended up hanging himself in jail because he... He knew his money couldn't get him out of what he got himself into. Checkmate. Like, share, subscribe.